And welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time, we got a lot of, mi a lot of miscellaneous stuff out of the way. And it was very productive, I would say, to say the least. This is, like I said, we're going to go see Miss Sadie, see if she has anything cool for us today. I'm also wondering when we actually get to go see uh, our favorite region from Red Dead 1. I don't believe I've had a play, little Sadie. Oh, John, <laughs> come sit down. Sure. You, uh, you got any work? Yeah. Well, there's always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing, or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except bastards, victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. And which are you, exactly? Me? In my time, all three. But same as most people. I guess. Well, funny thing about this job, well, opportunity. I just might get to be all three again. How you mean? <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, Shane Finley? Cattle wrestler? Murder, thief, child killer. He's wanted in five states. I caught him last week. He was disguised as a lady in a house for fallen women. I was bringing him in and I got robbed by a professional rival of mine. James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. Yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south waiting to head north so they can hand them in to the state troopers in the north country. I'd given up on the job as just a bad lot, but now that you're here, maybe we can go rob them back. Money good? Yeah. It's real good. Plus, I don't much like getting robbed by no one. Come on. Where is it we're heading again, you say? Mm. South. Now come on, mount up. We got a ride ahead of us. Wait. Of course we do. Where's my marker at? That's weird. Hmm. On, Are we going to where we think I'm going? Follow me. Let's ride. Yes, ma'am. That new horse? Some folk buy ranches, some buy horses. Horses are cheaper. He looks mean. He is. My ranch? It's something else, you know. You gotta come up there. Ain't had any trouble. Some squatters, but that's it for the most part. That's good. Maybe these fellers I heard about have stayed north or gone off somewhere else or dropped down dead in their own tracks. It's good country. All country is good. It's just folk that are bad. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Besides Uncle. Abigail? Uh, Abigail ain't come there just yet. Really? You, er, want to talk about it? Well, maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles? He's alive? Yeah. He's doing okay. He was prize fighting in San Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He took everything real hard. But I think life on the plains is gonna be good for him. I always like Charles. You send in my best. I mean, we're probably gonna walk right by the place. You know, you can come along too. Build a cabin on the land. I've done that all before. Can't do it again. I'm on my own now, John. I, I ain't so good with people. Uh, the offer's there whenever you want it. That's kind. Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. You heard anything of Dutch? Nothing. You? No. You'd think. He's a colorful character. Working mm. it out. That's one way of putting it. Look, what happened with the game changed everyone who was a part of it. The Dutch who put a blanket around me after the O'Driscolls. That weren't the same man at Beaver Hollow. And now, he might not be 
he's so colorful no more. You see a man whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. We were fools to follow him. I was a fool and I paid for it. What are you doing? And I was one of the lucky ones. Maka, John. Maka's the one who set it off. I blame me for following Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything else. He's out there. And someday, I hope we'll find him. But... Not now. Come on. Yay, auto travel. Where the heck are we going? I don't think we've been this part of the map yet. This doesn't look familiar to me. Are we going to New Austin? The new Austin, is that the new room called? Huh. That looks like, uh. I can't even hear his code. Where we can see over most of the country. They'll be down there. So, James Langton, the bounty hunter, has got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? Shane Finley, correct. And we aim to have Langton give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though, the giving back part is optimistic. I'm forever the optimist. We are in New Austin. Right? The Farland's Ranch. That's weird that there's States Landing that when you just traveled through here, I guess I didn't want to give me the entire map yet. This is awesome. You know, I've been doing some bounty hunting of my own since I last saw you. I ain't gonna make a habit of it. We cut off here. Okay, that was great to brought into the conversation. This is the place. Armadillo. It's a view, all right. Come on, let's go take a look down in the valley. Freaking Red Dead 1. Finally, we get to see this part of the map. I'm excited for this. Come on, John. Help me find it. I think I see something. Yup. There they are. Down there. How's it? Who's who? Well, the bounty is the feller who's all tied up. <laughs> Very funny. And that big fat fella with the funny hat, that's James Langton. The other fellas just work for him. Where do you think they're heading? I don't know. Come on. Let's go follow them. <sighs> Twin rocks, I'm guessing? That's my theory. That makes the most sense. Horse! There's okay. not a, don't do that right there. I mean, it actually is Let's fun run. Cutting through the canyon underneath us. Let's go. I'll follow you, Sadie. Ah. Oh, it's so good to see Red Dead One again. <laughs> Can I buy the herbalist map now? They'll be coming through here. What I want the most out of Red Dead 1. I miss that thing. Makes things easier to hunt plants. There they are. We follow and keep an eye on them. Easy. And they're hostile. That's fun. We know they're down there. Don't ride so close. Oh no, this is um uh, if you can't outgun them, you gotta outthink them. Crap, what is this place?
place called? This is where we had to hustle the cattle back out of uh, the Bones Ranch. We'll head them off there. This is awesome. See, they falls right should be just right there. Do the mushroom. That's it. Up here, get off your horse. This might be a uh bullet action in Litchfield. Let's go, um You know what? We don't use shotguns enough. Then again, I want to keep the lift filled up for one reason. What are they waiting for? Uh, the rest of Langton's men, I think. Langton's doing pretty well for himself. How come he's got all them men and you work alone? Uh, I got you. You're worth ten of them. <sighs> Great. All right, so what you think? Should we threaten them, start shooting at them, or sneak down and pick them off one by one? I reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity, but, uh, it's your call. We'll sneak. I'll follow your lead. Let's sneak down there. Okay, well, follow away. Stay down and stay close. Let's go. It makes most sense just to do that. Granted, if we just shoot him, we can try to get my headshot, my, um, math shots. Two guys ain't gonna do anything for me. The shotgun was a terrible quick pick. Man, I am struggling to shoot people this game. So for this mission. Oh, I don't have 
don't even want to buy a lot of... Alright, let's see how bad of a decision that's gonna be. Ah! Uh, I ended up killing the guy with the dynamite. Get on there. Sense. So where are we even going? So we have free room. Uh, I thought they even called it. I called it New Austin. I don't think it's called New Austin. It's called um, Armadillo. Take me back. I want to go back to Armadillo. Coming up on the jailhouse. Let's show this body to them. You better have read that bounty poster right. We'll see. Bring him and put him on a bed. Sheriff can call the Undertaker if he wants to. We brought in Shane Finley. Well, what's left of him? Really, game? Let me go through it. Oh, there's the one right beside him, huh? Look at this stupid piece of shit. Well, it certainly looks like him. Shame. I was looking forward to watching you swing. Throw him out back, would you? I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, 
and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Do it. Here. Here. There's a decent price on Finley. Mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> you want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. Yeah. John Marston here. All right, well, if you need any more work, you can find me in town. Or maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. Hey, $150 for money I don't have? I'll take it. That was a rough mission. Um, currently sitting pretty at what, 84.3? 0. 0.4, I'll take 0. 0.4. We still have two gang hideouts to do. Okay, how much time do we have left and what can we do? It's been 21 minutes. Well, that's an episode, guys. Next on Red Edition 2. Let's keep striving forward. See you then.